as president of Franciscan University, and on behalf of the friars, it gives me great pleasure to welcome you to the Baccalaureate Mass for the 64th commencement of Franciscan University of Steubenville. We are honored to have the Most Reverend Bishop Arthur Saratelli of Patterson, New Jersey as our celebrant and homilist today. We also welcome our diocesan administrator of the Diocese of Steubenville, Monsignor Kurt Kimo. Please join me in giving them a warm Franciscan welcome. I now ask Dr. Daniel Kempton, Vice President for Academic Affairs, to come forward for the conferral of the honorary degree upon Bishop Arthur Saratelli, and I invite His Excellency to join him at the podium. Father President, I present for the degree of Doctor of Christian Letters, honoris causa, whom the university has approved, Bishop Arthur Saratelli. The most important words Catholics speak every week and the words for which the martyrs shed their blood are the words of the holy sacrifice of the mass. These are the words the church offers in love, honor, and praise of God. And as of Advent 2011, these holiest of holy words are now more perfectly prayed in the English-speaking world. The process by which the church arrived at this new, more faithful translation was a long one, spanning more than 10 years. Likewise, the process by which the church in America prepared for the new translation was a methodical one carefully crafted to make the transition from the old to the new, not only as smooth as possible, but also as catechetical as possible. The hope was that the transition could be an opportunity for Catholics to come to understand and love the mass more deeply than before. That hope, that hope was realized thanks to the careful shepherding of Bishop Arthur Saratelli. As the former chairman of the U.S. Bishops Committee on Liturgy and current member of the Committee on Divine Worship, Bishop Saratelli helped plan and direct the transition process. That work was built on his many contributions to the new translation, contributions made through his service on the International Commission on English in the Liturgy and as Secretary of the Vatican's Vox Clara Committee. For his many contributions to upholding the sacred, beautiful, and true in Catholic liturgy, Franciscan University is proud to declare Bishop Arthur J. Saratelli Doctor of Christian Letters Honoris Causa. On this most important date in the light of this university, it is my privilege to be with you, parents and faculty with administration and staff are rightly proud of those who are graduated this day. Franciscan University has a unique place in our country. Since the opening of the first institution of higher learning, Catholic higher learning, in the United States immediately after the Revolutionary War, the number of Catholic colleges and universities 
has grown to 230. All of these schools must navigate today between the challenging demands of secularism and relativism on one side, and on the other side, the transcendent value of our Catholic faith. For all, Franciscan University, founded after the Second World War, has quickly become the light on the hill. You have remained a truly Catholic institution, passionate in your commitment to the church. Universities were first born ex corde ecclesiae, and this great university remains at the heart of the church. To a society increasingly becoming fragmented, you successfully offer your students a program not just of knowledge, but of formation and personal integration. In the marketplace of competing options, you have chosen to offer the Catholic intellectual tradition where faith and reason, science and theology are not enemies, but friends. Your authentic and trustworthy presentation of the truth leads your students to him who is the truth. The famous Rabbi Hillel once said, the world is equally balanced between good and evil, but God, Rev Hesed, the master of kindness, tips the scales toward kindness, toward goodness. It is our union with Christ that tips the scales to the good in our day. And because of your commitment to the path of wisdom, who is Jesus Christ himself, Franciscan University and her students are truly tipping the scales in the right direction. For all these reasons, I'm humbled by your honoring me today. Thank you and God bless you.